yeah, I did acrobatic gymnastics. Um, I'm a very competitive person, so I, I like I train a lot and try to be better every day. So I got to be on the Spanish team. Um, I was Spanish champion back in 2012, uh, 13 and 14. Um, I went to many international competitions and I got to the World Championship in 2014. That was in Paris and that was like, wow, a huge achievement for me. And then I had an injury. Um, so in gymnastics it's like um, very common to like fall during an acrobatic or something like that because it's a risky uh, sport. So actually I was doing um, something on the um, trampoline and then just, um, yeah, I don't know, I just uh, failed and I broke my leg. So I broke the two main um, bones, but the thing was that also my artery clog, and that was something they didn't realize at the moment, so there was no blood running on my leg. So I stayed there for the night and then the next day I was getting my, um, my surgery and they realized like there was no blood running so my leg was already dead they had to amputate my leg and i was a very active person and i couldn't imagine myself without sports so that was a tough moment for me i just wanted to like go back to sports because i, I love sports but i wasn't thinking about competing like, i wasn't mentally prepared for that i wanted to learn how to run again because it, it it had been like one year since my last um, the last time that I could run, so I wanted to run and I had to get a blade for that because you cannot run with the walking prosthetic leg. So yeah, my orthopedist gave me the blade and I just put it on and I was like very scared because it's very different, the technique and everything. And I remember I could just uh, run for 10 meters and I would fall or I would get tired. The Paralympics, it was a dream come true. I would say it's, it was the best moment of my life. I was very confident, I was in a good shape and I just was like living my dream. So it was, it was awesome. So I do 100 meters in long jump, but from after Paralympic Games, I specialize in long jump. Um, I ended up six in the Paralympic Games. I'm not used to the snow and I'm still like getting used to it. So here I'm like a, full-time student and that's something I really like because I can I don't have the opportunity to do that in Spain. I'm learning a lot here and also because my major is like it's a social study um, we have a lot of debate we can give our own opinion. I really like it here like I like the way that college works. I feel like my teachers are very prepared and, and they take into account that I am from Spain and my my English might not be as good as my other, uh, like the other students' English. Yeah, I feel like I'm enjoying it. Remember that nice lean and then drive through. Yeah, it was very important for me to be able to train here because otherwise I couldn't come. My coach, he's, he's Kevin, he's very nice um, and he's very professional and he like all the time tries to um, get me to explain my feelings because some of the exercises that I'm doing here are very different from the ones that I do in, back in Spain. I will learn a lot and I think it's gonna be worth it and then I'm gonna go back to Spain and have a lot of knowledge and yeah, try to apply it into my sports.